following the overwhelming support we had in our previous Excel video, which can be found in the link in the description, we've decided to fast track a new Microsoft Excel video for you all. In today's video, we'll be looking at some of the Excel features that you've probably never used and how it would benefit you in your day to day life as a quantity surveyor. But before we start, if you find this video useful, subscribing to our channel will be incredibly appreciated. We post new videos every Wednesday and have done so for two years. XLOOKUP This powerful function was introduced by Excel in 2019 and is designed to replace HLOOKUP and VLOOKUP. Let's take the item cloth tape. Here you want to find the total cost of this item using its unique reference. Most cost reports should have some form of reference. You can then use XLOOKUP. The first parameter is the lookup value, which is going to be 19. The array we're going to look up 19 is the reference column, and we want to return values from the total column. And that's all you need to do, it's that simple. Now, one of the biggest benefits of XLOOKUP is that it can do both vertical and horizontal lookups. So let's say you want to look up reference 7. You do equals XLOOKUP, open brackets, 7, lookup array on the reference row, and return array on totals, and then close brackets. This can be amended to solve any lookup problem you have. Forecast sheet. This is a great visual tool when completing CVRs or forward forecasts, and it's simple too. Let's give the example of the monthly labor cost on a project. Here, we have a list of months, and here we have the monthly cost of labor. We want to estimate the cost for the next four months. Simply highlight the cells, click data, and forecast sheet, and voila. As you can see, it automatically produces a great visual to show your forecasted cost, the lower confidence bound and the upper confidence bound. This can be used as a guide by yourself or used as a presentation tool when trying to explain numbers to the operation team. Now spreadsheets might excite SQSs, but it doesn't do much for the operations guys. They need pretty pictures. Quick analysis tool. We're going to use the same set of data and actually do something pretty similar. Have you ever wondered what this little icon at the bottom when you've highlighted a group of cells is? Well, this is the quick analysis tool, and here's what you can do with it. You can format, add graphs, totals, and spark lines. Once again, a great and easy visual tool to support your data. And finally, it's a quick fire round. Here's some shortcuts to make you more efficient in Excel. Control A selects all content on a workbook. Control 9 hides rows. Control 0 hides columns. F2 edits the selected cell, Control N opens a new workbook, and Alt F4 closes Excel. If you like this content, please comment below. We want to tailor the content around your needs, so if you like a specific video, the action of liking our video and commenting makes it incredibly easy for us and YouTube to see what content you guys like. Subscribing to our channel shows us support and shows YouTube that we're a channel worth subscribing to. Matrone a commercial hub to your business.